And the answer is, in this case, that the result is the same. And the reason the result is the same, if you think about it, is that we're going through these documents one by one, and we're adding the postal codes that map to a particular city, and we're going to inspect each source document once. And we know that the postal codes, which are in the underscore ID fields, which is what we're pushing, are unique in the collection because, of course, underscore ID is unique in the collection. So we know that it doesn't really matter whether we push it or add it to set. We should get the same answer. Now, I ran this on the actual data set, and it turns out that you don't get the exact same answer because the order the postal codes show up is slightly different. And I'm not actually sure why that would be the case, but it is. And I guess it doesn't guarantee the order. So what I did is I sorted them first. We're going to learn about sort very soon. And when I sorted all of the documents by postal code and then ran it, the result was exactly the same. And when I said the same, I meant the same from a set theory standpoint, which is that the same items appeared neat in the result. And I wasn't really thinking about the ordering of the items within the result set. But if you thought they were different because they might come up in a different order, the postal codes might be in a different order under each city, well then you can consider yourself correct as well. But for the purposes of this, I, I decided they were the same.